Hey guys, how are you? Look, listen, yesterday I was supposed to get on here and do the Motivational Mondays and you guys, I got so super, I woke up and my throat was really hurting me or whatever, so I was not feeling well at all. So I just wanted to get on here really quickly and talk about our motivations, um, our goals, our aspirations, continuing to have that momentum and what is like, what is your end result to your to the goals that you're setting or the goals that you have set? For me, mine is to, you know, one of my goals is to, um, my goodness, I don't even know what my goals is. <laughs> one of my goals is to graduate. So that, that's a long-term goal. Um, so I've already graduated with my certificate in fashion design. I accomplished that goal for this year. Um, my my next goal for that is to get my degrees in fashion merchandising and fashion design and also get my certificate in jewelry and metal smithing. So those are two goals that I will be working on and uh, God willing, I should be done with those goals by either 2019 or 2020. Also, um, one of my goals now, um, since I, I have been thinking that I wanted to go ahead and get like some type of office space, um, or now some type of affordable space for myself, because right now I am working out of my home and by me working out of my home, sometimes that can be a hindrance to me because when I get home, I just want to just really just lay down. Sorry guys. I'm looking at something, my, something's on my glasses. Okay. Anyhow, um, you know, sometimes when I get home, because I've worked so hard uh, by cleaning houses and also going to school and running myself and my son around, when I get home, I just want to crash. You know, I just want to relax and unwind and things like that. And that could be a hindrance to me by being an entrepreneur. So what I want to accomplish or what I want to do is get a space where I can go and actually create and work. And I found a space. Um, it's an artist loft. It is uh, not too far from me, probably about mm, 15 minutes to 20 minutes away from me. It also sits in between my home and one of the colleges that I attend. So on my downtime, I can actually, you know, well, not on my downtime, but like once I leave home or once I leave school, I can actually go there and work. And the perfect thing about this is I have tw I will have 24 hour access. I will um, be able to put on my fashion shows there, do, um, you know, my interviews there, also do photo shoots there. And there are other like minded creatives there so that, um, that I'll be able to also, you know, get continue to have that uh, motivation and encouragement. And, you know, sometimes you just need that spark. So when you see other people being creative, it actually lights a fire in you, um, what it does for me, to want to continue to be more creative, to, you know, to just get out of my shell or out of my mind because a lot of times I can have so many projects but they're up here and I'm not manifesting them outwardly which means you know if if they're just up here nobody's seeing them I'm not making any revenue you know and I'm just being stagnant you know sometimes that could be a fear of not being good enough or failure or whatever but you know now I'm starting to realize that plenty of people fail plenty of people have failed and if I fail so what you know um just if that doesn't work try something else and see if that works you know sometimes people say you know throw something against the wall and see what sticks a lot of successful people have done that so those are the things that I am doing and I will continue to do I have God willing I will have three fashion shows that I will be doing um one in Miami in February 
one in Jamaica. I believe that one is in May and then one in Tacoma, Washington, and that's in June. Um, so, you know, that's those things I have to get prepared for and things like that. So I'm getting ready to take my trip in less than a week, actually. And I'm just grinding out. I just literally got done cleaning someone's home. As you can hear, my voice is, you know, raspy or whatever. Um, thank goodness I popped up this morning and I was just on it, you know, because I really was not feeling well yesterday. But I wanted to just let you guys know um, to continue to keep your momentum, write down your goals, you know, stay consistent, um, keep yourself accountable, try to see if you can have one or two accountability partners um be encouraged write notes down there are a lot of things that I'm getting ready to do and I don't really think I don't really care if people think that I'm insane when they come you know in my space because I'm going to be writing a lot of notes to myself a lot of positive affirmations and scriptures and things like that because I really want to make sure that 2018 that I hit that mark like I want to which is going to continue to allow me to be prepared for graduation for 2019 um you know one of my other goals is to save up money so I can go to London for uh to continue my skills in shoe design and uh, shoe apparel so there's plenty of things that I have to keep myself busy and I need to make sure that I do that comment uh, give me you know your feedback uh, leave comments below what you guys want me to talk about in the next motivational Monday or Tuesday and you guys just continue to just grind out and if you haven't been grinding out start somewhere you know, start somewhere and, and don't ever feel like you're not good enough. Don't ever feel like that that project or that idea is not good enough. You know, if it's eating away at you, my things have been waking me up in the middle of the night. God has been waking me up in the middle of the night like, baby, it's time to move. It's time to boogie. It's time to get this. So get it. Just do it like Nike, you know, um, Thank you guys for subscribing. Continue to spread the word about Love Me More Designs. Continue to be encouraged. Continue to do what you need to do in order to reach those goals. We are gold diggers over here, okay? G-O-A-L-D-I-G-G-E-R, not gold, you know? I want to make sure that I accomplish every single goal that I uh, strive to to, to do you know if it's something that's attainable even if it's something that looks like it's not attainable if I can try to do it best believe I'm going to try to do it until you know either God tells me no that's not for you or until I see that uh maybe I may have bit off more than I can chew and I need to reassess but um other than that it's no holds barred for me. It's no holds barred. I look forward to this 34 days in Jamaica. I'm telling you guys. And another thing, another thing that uh, is is motivating me is when I go and clean people's houses. I'm going to give you a pro and I'm going to give you a con. The con is messy, messy, messy people. People that just don't have any respect for the people that are cleaning their houses. And I'm not trying to talk bad about these people. I know that they may be living busy lives or things like that. But there's a certain amount of respect that you just should have for the person that's cleaning your home. You know, I should not know that you just got off the toilet. I'm sorry. I shouldn't. And that doesn't make me feel good when I have to clean your house. You know, or if you have a lot of products and things like that in your home, make it easy for me to clean your house because I'm going to clean your house. And when I do it, it's going to be sparkling clean. I'm going to leave it a hundred or a thousand times better than what it looked like. And it's going to smell fresh. You're going to come home if you're not already home and you're going to be like, oh, yes, this is lovely. The pros to cleaning homes for people and doing what I'm doing to um, support my grind and support my building my brand is 
seeing other people, other creatives, you know, people that they may not even be in the fashion industry. They could be, you know, um, composers, they could be, uh, you know, uh, bloggers or whatever, but just seeing other creatives and other people that are grinding out and doing what they're doing, our business people, that really, 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 really motivates me. So either or, the pro or the con, it definitely motivates me, but, um, and I also love my clients, my regular clients that I have, and clients that I just meet or may clean for once um, that show me that they appreciate me. So yeah, I just want to leave you guys with that. Just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going until you reach that mark. Once you reach that mark, um, uh, pat yourself on the back and go ahead and, you know, get to another goal. Get to another goal. We're never going to stop until we take our last breaths. That's how I am. So have a great day, guys, and um, just take care, okay? Bye.